What's good, Internet? My name is Attack Slug, and welcome back to my last play of WWE 2K17, my career mode. And the day is finally upon us to go for the U.S. Championship, fighting Seth freaking Rollins at the Royal Rumble 2017, which is actually in, like, two months here. I have heard that because of this 1.04 patch apparently broke something in the t-shirt sales, which is why I have zero t-shirt sales. Honestly, I think it's a better story that the fans really hated the gobbledygooker outfit, so that's what I'm going to go with it. Anyway, let's go fight Seth freaking Rollins. Let's go get this U.S. title, and then let's move on from there. Welcome to the Royal Rumble! One of my favorite events of the year, every year, even though the winner has been pretty predictable the past couple of years, but that's okay. Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, hell yeah! Okay, the rest of this card includes Kofi Kingston vs. D. Bry, John Cena vs. Cesaro, Primetime Players vs. Ambrose and Reigns, Jericho and The Rock, Randy Orton, Finn Balor, I would watch that. Uh, Triple H Brock Lesnar for the world title, myself and Seth, yeah, Seth Rollins for the US title, and the Rumble match itself, with I guess your first six participants being R Truth, Connor, Sami Zayn, Bray Wyatt, Fondango, Jack Swagger. What? Oh no, I'm backstage. There he is, King, wearing his trademark t shirt, walking past Vince and Rollins and Vin uh, Triple H. Not concerned about the authority. No, I'm, I'm totally not going to get screwed here, right? Right? I'm going to get me that U.S. title, Seth Rollins. I'm going to get it. Oh, that was a really bad botch to start the match off with. Anyway, welcome to Saturday. How's it going, you guys? Uh, we are here. It is a fine Saturday. Uh, so somehow survived Black Friday. I did get in a pre-order for that stupid 3DS, which won't ship until the 16th, and hopefully Walmart won't cancel it. Fingers crossed. Um, but otherwise, I've literally bought like one game, which was a copy of Spin Tires, which I'm hopefully going to have a, a video on soon, uh, with the with my racing wheel, which is kind of the whole point that I've, you know, the whole reason to buy it. Um, it was like six bucks. So, anyway, uh, wrestling is here and happening. News is pretty slim, but there is, you know, bits and pieces here and there. Out of the ring, going to the top for the five star slug splash. Um, so, woo! But you can't win the match outside of the ring, so get the architect back into the ring. Or not. Alright, well, he should, he should be healthy enough to get back in here. Anyway, they don't want none. Um, first news story is that your new GFW, which is Global Force Wrestling... Nice, Seth, nice. Your, your new GFW next-gen champion is Cody Rhodes. And I know what you're thinking. That, that is a shocking turn of events. Because they still have GFW. That's still a thing. That They're still running shows and matches. I have no idea. I legitimately had no idea. I had seen months ago that one of their titles was on eBay. You could buy one of their, one of their belts on eBay. And uh, my, my, my only awareness of... Jeff Jarrett lately has been trying to get you to invest in gold. So the fact that that they are still in business in, in some capacity is baffling. But yes, your new next gen champion. I don't know who he beat. Um, I think somebody said Sanjay Dutt, but I could be wrong. Uh, but yes, he he is your new champion. And I'm like, okay. I would have thought at this point he would have been either in New Japan or AAA or you know. Any, any number of larger, uh, any number of larger deals, and not GFW. So, what do I know? What do I know? Seth Rollins no sells the pedigree. You motherfucker! I'm gonna run through you, Seth Rollins. I'm gonna run through you. Um, yeah. So that that, that was a weird bit of a news thing uh, for today. But otherwise, uh, apparently. According to Facebook reviews, and obviously not the most reliable thing in the world, but according to Facebook reviews, Del Rio's restaurant that he opened in, I guess, San Antonio or somewhere in Texas is not very good. Um, a lot of folks who were not happy with his restaurant. Woo! 
That was an excellent five-star slug splash. I appreciate that a whole lot. Yep. All right. Um, and yeah, that's kind of the extent of uh, the news stories happening today. Uh, so my, my, my focus here, obviously, is on winning this U.S. championship. And waiting on Seth Rollins to wake up. And waiting on this ref to... Uh, oh, no! I'm busy doing the Randy Orton pose. Whoops. What's going on, Seth, here? So many neck breakers. So many. Yeah. You don't want none. You don't want none. Seth has gotten minimal offense in here in this match, but he's still at like 89%, which is crazy. I was at 93. That seems like a that seems like a fucking setup. Either he's only getting it from reversals, or I don't know. It seems like a damn setup, but that's okay. I'm gonna hit me a slug exploder. I'm gonna go to the top for the slug 30. The slug 30 centon. Slug 30 centon to finish Seth Rollins to win the match and to gain the U.S. Didn't, didn't get it. Didn't get it. Dear God, I've hit two finishers. He knows all the pedigree and kicked out of the of the slug 30. What else do I have to possibly do to put away Seth Rollins? Whoa! All right, he reversed that. He's not happy. Please, please don't suicide dive. Please don't suicide dive. Please. Shit. I missed the major reversal. And I got hit with that. I mean, he can win if I get if I get counted out. He can totally win. So, fuck that. Fuck that. Backstabber. Yeah, dig it. Phone's going off, that's okay. I'm gonna win this damn belt. By hook or by crook. This is going to happen, says Seth Rollins. Stop trying to prevent it from happening. Oops. Didn't mean to run there. Just meant to do a move. Just meant to do a gut wrench. Or no, I'm sorry. Yeah. A gut wrench. Suplex. Fuck the fuck off. Shockingly enough, there's been no interference from... There's been no interference from the authority. Um... I am not going to go for this as a third time. I think going to the well twice and having it work uh, is certainly okay. But going to the well a third time uh, might just backfire on my ass. So we're not going to do that. We're going to have a competitive match here. Punch him, punch him, punch him. Run away. All right, Seth Rollins. It is time for you to eat the slug exploder and then time for you to eat the salt shaker. 2.0, and then we shall win this con. There we go. Okay, slug exploder. Pick the man up. Pick the man up. Middle of the ring. Middle of the damn ring. Salt shaker. Two point. Oh yeah, that should do it. I should be your new U.S. champion. What a maneuver. What a maneuver. New champion crowned. That's right. It's me. It's me. It's the S L U G. Give me the damn belt. Give me the damn trophy. Yeah. Mine. That's right. New champion. Seth Rollins. Oh, I can break out. Can I pick up the belt? Yes, I can. Seth Rollins. Fuck you. Boom. Boom. On the belt, with his head on the belt, going to the top for another slug 30 centon. Boom! How about that, Seth Rollins? How about that? Insult to injury. No forgiveness. No forgiveness. 95 points. Instant classic. Attention. Your rank increased. You damn right it did. I am now the number one spot on this show with the U.S. champion uh, for, you know, main event and shit. Anyway. Anyway. Rolling into SmackDown, which we're not going to play because of a certain reason. And I will explain to you, for those of you who have watched all the way to the end of this video, 
I will explain to you what is going to happen now. Now, per the order of WWE 2K17, Attack Slug has been suspended for his use of performance enhancing pizza. Therefore, he will be demoted to NXT. But only after he serves his time. And how, how will he spend those next 30-ish days, perhaps around 27? I tune in tomorrow to find out. That's all I can tell you. That being said, I am your host, Attack Slug. More videos every day. Come back tomorrow at 5 p.m. to find out what's going to happen. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time, right here on this channel, and I'm out.